Okay, good day everyone. Uh, I'm Dylan Lin, a product manager in Cheetah Mobile, and I'm in charge with the uh, SIM security app. Today I will share our story and our experience to you about how, how do we earn uh, millions of users from zero. Okay, let's begin. Uh, we are Cheetah Mobile and the world top, uh, the world tour mobile publisher in uh, Google Play. And we have almost 650 million uh, users use our, use our apps. That's roughly one in 10 people in the earth. So almost we have, uh, almost we have almost 80% of global internet users. All the revenue from our, uh, all the revenue from our CM tools is growing every year by two or three times. In the past three years, We've been aggressive due to this approach, due to this strong approach, Cheetah Mobile has over 100% revenue from 12 consecutive quarters. Compared with 2014, we had a breakthrough last year. Tools app gave us over 200% revenue growth, around 500 million US dollars. It made us become more undefeatable. This achievement relates to our product strategy. Based on Cleanmaster, Cleanmaster, our flagship product, we build up a strong and stable product network by user experience, making user has the need to use our product every single day. And user can course use every product by internal, uh, by internal recommendation. So that is why every tool app has strong connection and interaction. According to the ranking of Android platform, the top 30 download apps in Google Play, there are five from Cheetah Mobile. Cleanmaster, CM Security, Battery Data take the top three spot in tools app category. Piano Tiles 2 and Photogrip take the top spot in games and camera type respectively. We have more than 100 apps in the market. Leading the pack are CM apps like Cleanmaster, CM Security. We have a user experience research system and a fast tempo product life circle. Cheetah Mobile has a great achievement in and keeping provide the best experience to all the smartphone users. This is Cleanmaster. Cleanmaster focus on junk cleaning and phone boost. And this is SIM security. SIM security focuses on antivirus and privacy protection. Before 2012, we faced a terrible junction uh, that our, multiple, our multi domestic rivals prevent us from expanding our business in a security field for computers and mobile devices. We started, we started to think about what should we do next, where's our future, and how to set up our next strategy. So we stayed up and went to Silicon Valley to do a local study. In there, we found there are three largest types of mobile application in the United States. There are games, social media, and communication. Also, they have a leading brand to represent their own products. Only the tools application were scattered and dispersed. Even a few spring product can earn 100 million users. So we made a decision accordingly. We must find and differentiate the battlefield, be international. After setting up the strategy internationalization, we focused on only Android and Google Play. The largest market, made, uh, the largest market to make our target more specific. Then we started to explore the search engine on Google Play and, trying, and typing all the app's keywords step by step. We found that there are four words had the most frequently exposure. They are clean, antivirus, battery, and system, which reflected the most popular demand from the general user, especially the word clean. The search volume was four times compared with battery, 10 times over the antivirus. 
In the meantime, most worldwide users were having the low-end mobile devices that just gave us a great opportunity to fix those inborn defects of junk cleaning and space opt optimization. When we saw the point that when we saw the point that we could work on, we started to quick testing immediately. We spared three people and rapidly made a primitive clean master English version online. Unexpectedly, we got the 50,000 download in the first day. That was, uh, that was far more than battery data, which we spent more manpower on. The test told us that we don't need to numerous the resource to develop a domestic antivirus app. By cutting the edge market of clean up tools, you can avoid the oncoming attack and have a chance gaining the possibility to expand internationally. We choose to go all in. We focus on single point so that we can ask all of the resource to join us and run faster than competitor. We ask more than 200 engineers to join the clean master team and focus on clean jump function we mentioned before. We, discre uh, we discreetly look into every model to see where the inside junk that competitor cannot help you to clean it, and we help you to remove this. The competitor help you to save your space, then we help you to save a double space. In users need clean up function, clean up direction, we keep requesting to pursue ultimate perfection. In a year, from 2013 to 2014, we released 136 versions, increased user from a million to 200 millions. There were thousands of users review us on Google Play and gave us the score of 4.7. The score is a better rating than, top, than the other top application like Facebook and WhatsApp. To design a good product, you have to think about, you have to focus about user experience. This picture is last month our product team went, uh, went to New Delhi and come to Bangalore to do the user experience. We very, uh, we very focus on user, user experience because uh, we think the core of the product is user. So we have to remind ourselves every time when we have a new idea, is, this, uh, the, is the idea is good for the user use or not? Will the user use this idea? Uh, will it jeopardize the user's experience and make users uh, uninstall us? Or will, uh, will it make users more love with us? To make sure our idea is uh, a good idea for the user want, we need to quick verification. Uh, to do the quick verification, we have some methods, like fast pass, error trying, and MVP. Fast pass means in Cheetah Mobile, we release every new version every week. So we can try anything, any idea in a short time. Fast pass helps us to quick verification. And error trying means don't be afraid to try anything and don't be afraid to make error. Make error can help us find the right direction. To solve the all resources, to solve the all resource, we always release the MVP, minimal viable product. And the most important is we can release the product in the morning and we get and analyze the data in the evening. The core value of data for us is to we can reverse the uh, we can revert the user behavior and scenario from our data. Then we can find the problem. Then we can improve it. Then uh, how to get the good user experience to the user? We start from the uh, user thinking, user scenario. Think about the real scenario that the user has actually encountered, which is mean create a solution for that scenario and optimize it to create a high value. 
For example, first I can share to you is things deepening. Use a sentence to describe, to describe the things deepening is extending the core function user need. Let them feel we are familiar with them. For example, since security has a function called private browsing, it's an incognito browser that can let you go any website with any chest, safe and private. Every time, when you, uh, every time before you closing the browser, an animation will appear with a brush. This animation tell you we want to clean all the browsing data so you don't need to worry about the browsing history anymore. This animation impress user and we continue to modify the animation more than a hundred times. Another case is app lock and intruder selfie. App lock. Uh, also, the function in CM security, it can help you to lock any of your app in your phone to prevent the stranger who want to access your application or your phone. It's a powerful feature with a great, great reputation. We continue to think about the user scenario when they use app lock. We found the lock is associated, is associated with snoopers, so we make the extend, extend function called into the selfie. When someone, input, when someone input the wrong password two or three times, a photo of them will be taken secretly and it will automatically mail to you. Now, we help people, we help our user to catch more than four million intruders every day. Also, our user love it. Besides the scenes deepening, there are a few ways to enhance user experience, like scenes front. Scenes front uh, is putting the function on user's daily frequency path. That can help us to make our job more obviously. Let the user think, wow, CM, Chita Mobile CM did a lot for me. Some applications don't tell the user, uh, don't tell the user their value. So the user will never know they are protect her, protect them. In our strategy, no matter what app or file you download, we will let you know what we've done for you and how safe it is. Another example is according to our user's feedback. We found out that many people ask, hey, I forgot my password, how can I find it? Hey, how can I change my password? Previously, if you want to change the password, there are a lot of steps you need to assess. For example, you have opened the CM security and go to the menu and choose the app lock function, then press the setting button. Then you will see the option about change password. Honestly to say, actually, the path is too long for the user then we realize we need to change the scenario with a user experience, rethinking, rethinking how best to suit their need. So we made it possible to assess password change from the app lock unlock screen. It enhances user perception and also solves the main problem. User experience is not only the product side, as there are many points need to be examined. For example, multiple language. We provide a worldwide application. So we need to support all of the language, especially the user's feedback. We use their native language to communicate with all of our users. Hindi, Hindi Spanish, French, Arabic, English, Chinese. All the language are translated by our user, our friend. Yes, that's true. Our users, also our friend, our, our fans and our friends help us to, trans, uh, to translate all of the product language. We have a loyalty users, they're always willing to help do anything, including the feedback or uh, reply the user or help us test our beta product. All of the fans become our friend and they are selfless and put us to the next level. 
we have the biggest fans online community. We have Line, uh, we have Line Google, Play, uh, Google Plus, Facebook, and WeChat group. There are over a million users interactive with us on that platform. We talk about anything like joke, live, uh, feature suggestion, or product feedback. And we discuss this stuff directly with a product manager every day. We let, let, we let them test beta function and manage our social media platform. Yeah, that's true. Lots of, lots of our fans also be our moderators. We ask them, or we ask them help, no, no, no. Uh, they volunteer to help us to uh, manage our social media. They answer the user's feedback, and they help us get more fans. And translate the language of our products. We are digging for the co fans there are chain land. Uh, we are digging for the co fans there to train them be our fans product manager. Fans product manager can uh, have a weekly meeting with our product manager and supervisor. And we, we will put their name in our app and on Google Play. So our fans, those co friends, will feel honored and make them more active and interactive. The global strategy, the single point, user experience, user scenario, all in. Those methods and the strategy help us to earn the user from zero to 100 million. When we got the users, then we can make money. The method we use to make money is advertisement. For Cheetah Mobile, we don't want to jeopardize the user's experience. So to, sure, to ensure they are remain happy, we have no pop-up window like you might see in the game before. The user have to use our application first to solve their problem. Maybe clean the junk, maybe clean the, anti uh, clean the viruses. Then the user will be taken to the result page. In that page, scroll on that page, you might be seeing some adver advertisement here. Then you can just ignore them or feel free to, uh, to tap that image. Also, Facebook use our, uh, also, our net advertisement also uh, used by Facebook to be a template to share to the other company. For Cheetah Mobile, we success, uh, we success translate, transfer traffic to the money. Having some of the most powerful applications around the world, uh, we hope we can make the world the, we hope we can make the mobile internet better than before. Here is my presentation. Thank you, guys. So, Dylan, three things, right? One, some really cool features. <laughs> um, some really interesting ways of leveraging your users and the user community itself. Yes. And thirdly, some mind-blowing numbers. So, can we have a huge round of applause? Uh, for Dylan from Cheetah Mobile. And if there are any questions, uh, we'll take a maximum of one question, and I'm sure Dylan is going to be available. Can we please have a mic there for the person? Thank you. Uh, yeah, actually, I wanted to ask, how do you test your applications for, like, a large number of users? Uh, sorry, you mean, how do I? Uh, test your applications for the external users. Test, test, test your application. Oh, test the application for the user. You mean how do I test the application for the user? Yeah. Okay. Uh, actually, we uh, actually we release every application every week. So, uh, for example, uh, if we have a new idea, we will pub uh, we will release it to Google Play this week, and. Uh, usually, we release this application in the morning, and in the evening, we will receive the data. Then we can analyze this data. So if we, uh, so if we uh, analyze the data and find something wrong or 
finds our strategy is bad for the user, then the next week we will publish, we will release a new version without the idea uh, we want to test before. So that's how we test the new function for the user. All right, great, Dylan. Thank you so much for coming and sharing. Here's a small token of appreciation from um, Indigo Nation. Thank you. Thank you.